Okay, cool. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh God. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, I just killed it. Oh, that's not good. Hey guys, Lee here, and welcome back to the video. So today, I am here on Looming Legacy, and we are continuing our little adventure in Looming Legacy. So basically, last time we found Duskit, and uh, we beat him, and we kind of saved him. We made it easier, so he, yeah, actually, so he was not cursed or corrupted anymore. So this is a little stone thing that we had here. I didn't actually press it. What does this do? I think we don't need to do anything. This is where it came out from. In this episode, we're going to try to go to Sylvian City, or Sylvan City, and we have to go uh, battle somebody. Uh, there's currently something over here, but unfortunately, we can't. It's Mysterious Veil of Darkness. It seems like you cannot move through it. Okay, so there's something over there currently. We do not have enough. Uh, we don't have the little light thing to break through it. So basically, what we have to do is that we have to go to Sylvian Battles Theater, and we have to go beat a professional or a battle champion or whatever. First things, though, is that we need to heal our Pokemon, uh, and currently, they're very low, and we, we need to do it. <laughs> so, we're gonna do, I don't know if I, oh no, leave me alone, girl, seriously, oh my god. The force is creepy. You're creepy, look, look, look how creepy they are. Uh, you can get up by quickly following this trip, but you fully leave, let's have a battle. I don't want to battle you, though. Alice, we like to battle, I don't want to battle Alice, Alice at a twiddle. Go, Buckbeak. <laughs> I don't want to do this. Oh, because they, they, so they are all a little bit uh, healed, I believe. Let's just look at our Lumion so far. Never mind, they're not healed. Buckbeak's just like that. Uh, fight. Let's go fight him right now. I guess we have to shine. Shine usually is pretty good. Um, ow. Oh, crap. I was paralyzed. I can't move. That's not good. That's, that's, that's not good at all. Okay, that was pretty effective, I guess. We're going to pounce to see what that does. Hopefully, dawdle. Mobility defense fell down. Okay, they're dead. Hopefully, we don't have to send anymore because we want to go heal our Pokemon and stuff like that. All right, you're free to go. All right, so we're going to go into the city right now, guys. We're going to explore a little bit more. Hopefully, we can find some sort of, like, medicine place or something that we can... Oh, Chesma Town is the name of it. Lovely, okay. There's a whole bunch of people here, little cute areas. What is this? This looks like the place I need to go because there's a little Lumion thing. Hopefully, we can buy some stuff here, like some more Lumion discs and stuff like that. Okay, let's see. Hello, are you the nurse here? I don't like how, like, inside you can't, like, do that. Okay. Welcome to Lumion Goods. How may I help you? Uh, let's browse. So, we get some capture discs. Those are a little expensive. What's an ace disc? A rare capture disc will always capture wild Lumion without fail. Okay, so I can't actually get that. Lovely. So we have 1,416, okay. So I can buy, uh, let's buy a few of these. Uh, how much should that be? Uh, let's buy, let's buy three Lumion discs for now. You wanna buy three, that'll be okay. Cool, there you go, cool. And then we wanna buy some small meds. Is there anything else we can buy here? Not currently, so we're gonna buy, let's buy, let's buy one small med for now. Yep, cool, this is expensive. Okay, cool, we'll go out of here now. Uh, is there anything else I may do for you? What's happening? We hit sell, but I'm going to do that this is time. Is there anything else I can help you for you? Cancel. So, I see something over here. Am I able to... Would you like to rest your Lumions? Yes, I would. Cool. So, here we can rest our Lumions. They are currently charging. That, okay, cool. That was quick. Are they all rested? I think they are. Let's see. What, what are you here? Okay, are you? Oh, they're... he's not so happy. Buckbeak is kind of bored. Oh, shut up, Buckbeak. Okay, you know what? I did not, I, I did ask, but, um, so for here, I don't think there's anything else. We've got our Lumions nice and healed. We bought some stuff. That's really what we needed to do. Um, so now we're going to go over to Sylvian Battle City. I do not know where that is, though. That is a bit of an issue, isn't it? Hello, let's talk to you. This is Lumion Train Station. From here, you can rush Lumions and buy supplies to keep them healthy in the battle. Lumion Care also takes place from the free public space access portal there, where you can swap which of your Lumions you carry with you. Okay, currently, I don't have enough Lumions to actually do that. Hello there, sir. Took Emmett out to Route 3 to train for a while. She lost too much health. I brought her here to Lumen Changer Station to get some rest and stock up on more supplies. Gotta make sure Emmett says tip top station. She can do her best. Awesome. Okay. So we can go down here now. I do not know actually what Sylvia and Battle City is. We'll talk to more people. I moved here from Big City. This life, this life, that wasn't for me. Nothing can uh, be this life of living in a small town in the country. Quiet's running, cleaner is all I need. You do you? Okay. Um, I don't know anything else. This is a vending machine. 
Hello. Do you know that Lumen Boost can be used by trying to increase how quickly their Lumens grow? You spend special tokens up for free toys. I get my boost from the machine, but if you have here a Lumi watch, you can just buy them from there. So I don't actually know what these Lumi boosts are. I don't know how to get them. Hello, I heard the forest behind the chest of guard by a spirit. Rumors has a Lumi and trainer involved in a tragic accident. Both passed away in the woods. The family of the trainer has buried his body under a beautiful tree. The boy's Lumi watches over the area. Such a fascinating story, but the idea of a spirit in the woods has kept me from ever exploring it. Interesting. So it might be a little bit of Duskit's background. Okay. So going here, I don't actually see, I don't know how to get to Sylvian Battle City, you have to figure this out. I don't know what this building is, and I kind of want to go inside, but I can't find the entrance to go in. Can we go in here? Oh, we can go in here, okay. Um, hello there, sir, you have no hair. Hello, my family just lived in this town for many generations. It's a very old town with a lot of history. Have you heard of the ruins that are said to exist in the forest outside of Chesma Town? Someone said it has discovered remains of an old civilization down in the woods, where the locals haven't a clue where they, who they are and who they made them. So apparently there's something up there. And there's this guy like on the roof up here that I want to talk to to see if I can go. Oh, hello. My husband and I are fascinated with the history. Aurora happens to have a lot of history. There are also many human, Lumian civilizations to come and go through this time. There are many secrets and ancient mysteries to discover all over Aurora. After spending your are you traveling or over, we decided to sail back down here in Chesma Town, where my husband was originally from. Even though we're both pretty old now, there is still plenty of stories to be unfolded here. So lots of people are like, this is a lot of history and stuff. Uh, so this is kind of interesting. Can I use this computer? I cannot. So I'm going to go back down to Route 1. I don't know where to actually go. Maybe where we eventually found that those people. Okay, we're going back with the way we came. I'm not sure exactly where Sylvian City is. Uh, mm. A twiddle. I don't have a twiddle, actually. I want to get a twiddle. Okay, we're going to do this. We're going to fight you. We're going to do something that's not that much energy. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, I just killed it. Oh, uh, that's not good. Actually, I think we need to go back to Chesima Town because I think there's another way to get over there, but I'm not positive to which way I had to go. Cool. We'll go over here. There's a chest right here. Maybe I can see. What is this? What is this? Oh, I got some capture disc. Awesome. The capture disc was stored in the item app. Awesome. Okay, this should not, this should really not be this hard, but I'm just, uh, what is this guy doing up here? He's just kind of vibing with his hammer. Okay, this is where I was last time. We went past this little lake thing. What are you doing here, sir? You aren't from around here, are you? There's a school in here in town. There's a ton of information about this town and the Lumians in general. You should swing by to see if you can learn anything. Where's there a school in this town? Wait, what? Oh? Oh? I never heard of a disruptive, disrespectful group of kids in this class. I'm going to have a talk with your parents. Don't bother. We're not coming back. Yeah, we don't have time for this lame school. Well, hey, because Mabel Bond made her. We tagged along to support our friends. If she goes, so do we. Well, if that's the case, don't let me catch you on my students anymore. Don't worry. We're leaving this lame town. I don't need a school to help me learn about Lumians. I could do it on my own. Hey, you. Are you, f are you here for the school? You look pretty weak, so I bet you are. Well, don't waste your time. Lumen battles don't require any trainer strategy. The only thing that matters is sheer power. Yeah, I got you pinning back. Wham pow, wham bam pow. Uh, yeah, what they said. I already wasted enough time here. Lucy, Lucas, let's get out of here. Are they twins? Okay. Those children are very misguided. Mabel, the leader of the three, doesn't even have any Lumians. I simply do not understand what she got her perspective. She believes the outcome of Lumen battles is purely dictated. By Lumian's raw strength. There's much more to battle than just strength, though. Why did you come for the school moment? I can show you what I mean. Okay. And, and here is a wealth of no knowledge about Lumian battles. You can discuss various battle mechanics with these other students. I would like to personally explain how Lumian team works. All official Lumian trainers are permitted to carry up to seven Lumians, but will only be able to use five in a given battle. The last two spots in your lineup are known as your Lumian's bench. Lumians are set on the bench with pods passively gain a small amount of experience as you battle, but they cannot participate in the battle itself. Between battles, you may swap Lumians on and off the bench. With the knowledge of that, you can be building your own strategies to compete with other trainers. Go ahead and see what else you can learn before you take off on your adventure. Thank you, teacher. You let a random child into your class. I appreciate that. So I guess you have to talk to other students, but I'm socially awkward. And I don't want to talk to other students, but you know what? We will in a second because I don't see much else to do. There's this kid by the bookshelf. You seem to be quiet. Okay. Oh, I'm climbing stuff now. Wait, what? Oh, you have a Lumi watch. I bet you have access to lots of useful information about Lumians you catch in your Lumipedia. I get it. I get it all by reading these books. So I wish I could do my learning from actual experience, but my parents are not ready to adventure on my own yet. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Hello, students. Hello, fellow students. Uh, okay. There are actually some moves that, we use, um, that can be used that will always go first, no matter the opponent's speed. I prefer the hardest element of surprise with these toxic moves. Okay, cool. 
Okay. I've been telling everyone to start a fast swimming is a key to success. The Lumen with a higher speed still will be able to strike first in battle. Hitting first hits is often the greatest advantage in a battle. Okay, so speed is good. Okay. Every Lumen has a secret potential. Sometimes Lumen ability is to get what it gives as your battle. Many Lumens are just some Lumen ability. Some abilities are only found very rarely. Okay. There's so much to learn about Lumians. I'm going to learn as much as I can about each, in each individual Lumian so I can plan perfect battle strategies. Once you develop the best uh, battle techniques, there'll be no battle star and warrior that can beat me. I know, like, you got this kid. He looks like the kid from the house house inside the uh, the clock inside the walls. Doesn't he look like that kid? No? Okay. Hello, you look like LD Shadow Lady. A Lumian can, train, a Lumian can get experience from training points until it reaches a combined total of 500. Bam. Each guy only uh, have a total of 200 points out each, and you will have to divide your training points between different stats to get the most out of them. Okay. So, leave for every 4 GP you earn a particular stat, your Lumian gets stronger. Okay. Lumians have uh, hidden stats called Alice TP. These stand for training points. Each time a Lumian knocks out another battle, they will reach TP points depending on which species of their opponent knocked out. Each stat can receive training points, whether you accumulate enough points to their stat total, the stat will go up. Okay. Now, just because Lumian has a weak attack, that doesn't mean it's uh, useless in battle. Sometimes a strong defense can make up for a good offense. To be honest, there's many battle strategies outside of raw power. So apparently, uh, you could don't have to. Oh, she's happy. They're happy now. But he's content. That's good. So apparently, some, if you don't have a really good, you could just be a good like defense thing. Try to memorize the different Lumian types, their weaknesses, and their strengths. It can be hard to remember that much information, but the teachers a chart on the wall to make it easier. Remember. I also heard the hero Lumian watch when your battle moves will indicate if they're strong or weak against the opponent. You think it's by arrows and the attacker's name. Oh, I did not know that. Okay. There's someone over here. Okay, hello. Are there children? There's a lot of kids. I think it's important to prioritize the Lumian's health stat. The more heads it can withstand. Okay, I agree with that. That's good. I think it's more to present Lumen's energy stat. The more energy Lumen has, the more hits it can dish out before needing to rest. That is also true. I don't know. I think a little mix of both is pretty good. Alright, every Lumen has, uh, every stat has Lumen gets up, goes up or down. A higher, uh, the highest up value, uh, UP value, is possible 40. Training Lumen in battle will never raise or lower its UP values. I have read in books that were though that it's theoretically possible to raise a Lumen's up values. Uh, UP or up? Every Lumen is born with image stats called unique points or up for short. The natural streak weaknesses uh, for the stats of each, every individual Lumen. Hardcore trainers will want the Lumen with the highest unique points because they can make up a difference when it comes down to it. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go out here now. I don't think there's anything else in here for us. We did check out. We talked to some Lumian stuff. I'm not going to remember any of that, but okay. Hello there, sir. How are you? We would need to take a break from sit down for a while. I just walked away here from Sylvian City to come visit my parents. And Lumians love when I make this trip because they had a lot of battle experience when we pass through the Route 3. So Sylvian City is this way currently. We're going to go back down this way. Lovely. Route 3. Let's talk to the Route 2. So let's talk to this guy right here. Uh, let's see. Hello. Hi, oh, hello, Lumian Trader. Have you heard of the sound I've been looking for studying my You see, there's one mysterious dust running their wings. If I get a sample of this dust, I can create uh, anti toxins to counteract their effects. I could invent a special potion to cure those stats of ailments. If you have if you have a summons, please show it to me. Uh, yeah, sorry. I, I don't have one, sir. I'm very, very sorry. Can I go in your house, though? I can't. I'm very sorry. Okay, well, sorry, sir. I don't have any of that stuff. Okay. Go up here. We can go back down this way. There seems to be construction or something here. Let's not fall through the water. That would be bad. Where is Tori to go? Let's have a battle. I don't want to have a battle. Jeez. Moments later. Let's go to here. Let us do shine. Shine's usually pretty effective. Yeah, that was really effective. Okay, cool. We'll fight him again. Let's just do pounce because that's really, you don't need anything for that. Cool, it's fainted. Nice, nice, nice. Buckbeak gained 48 experience. Nice. Buckbeak grew to level 13. Yay! Buckbeak's trying to learn the move Peck, but already knows four moves. Uh, should Buckbeak forget a move in order to learn Peck? Um, sure. Which move should be forgotten? Um, okay. Unexpectedly dash at a target. Uh, damage for the bright lights. Uh, stare at their, uh, lowering their defense. Declare your hostility for promoting lower their attack. Uh, swoop it through the air and strike and target. Uh, this is a hundred attack, uh, which is pretty good. I'll oh, make it. Oh wait, uh, with a shark beak. Um, let us do. Uh, let us do stare for now. Yes, I'm so sad that they can only learn like four things. Okay. Nice. So let's try peck right now to see how this works. Benjamin getting experience and watching. Nice. Uh, you're really in a hurry, huh? Yeah, I am, so leave me alone. Go over here. Cool, we're gonna go finally to here. We can actually, I don't know if we have enough time to battle somebody, but let us see. Oh, a Geklo! Oh, you are cute! You are cute! You know, we'll fight you. We're gonna... Peg... We're gonna pounce. Let's see, pounce. Okay, now, oh, that's so cute. Look how cute he is! Look how cute he is. We're going to get items, and we're going to get some capture discs, and we're going to use this. Let's see. Throw him to see if it works. Oh, the Geklo is so cute. Oh, my God. 
Yay! I could not find any names in the last episode for a Gecklo. I could not find any names for a Gecklo in the last episode in the comments. So for now, we're going to not name it, I don't believe. You know what? We'll name it Geico. <laughs> How do you spell Geico? Geico? Yes, your name is Geico. But being 42, 49 40, experience, you're a bunch of them getting experience from watching. Awesome. So we got a Gecklo right now, or Geico the Gecklo. <laughs> Okay, let's just ignore you. Okay, we behind, apparently we go behind them. What is this? <laughs> what is this? What? Okay, we'll go all the way over here. Um, there's will be a whole bunch of different stuff. Hello, sir. Let's. Can you tell me what's going on over here? Uh, you gotta be careful while mining these crystals. A lot of Gecklo live here, and they're pretty territorial. I have one jump on me earlier. You know, scared me to death. Okay, so apparently there's a lot of Gecklo in here. What are you? Uh, excuse me. Ah, uh, this is my prize, Borak. He can smash through rock on more than many fights. He's trying to find out any Gecklo that tries to give us problems. So probably like, Gecklos are really a problem here. Um, interesting. Uh, I don't currently see... Okay, this must be... Why is there just, like, a random thing here? Okay, see, this is boss. He's gonna replace me with another Borak if I don't stop taking breaks. Why is he trying coming out here and getting tapped by Gecklo with a bunch of shiny rocks? See how he likes it. Uh, so apparently this is not good. They're doing something bad here. That's what I can see at least from when I am getting this vibe here. One here. We just want to find Sylvian City, but I cannot find it actually. Okay, let's see. Is there stuff in here? I, there's no one in here currently. There's nothing I can take from in here. Uh, let's just look over. Uh, no, there's nothing in here. There's a whole bunch of like, uh, papers and stuff. Oh, no. Oh, oh, God. Okay, let's go to here. A babor! A babor! Oh, my goodness! A babor! Hello there. Uh, I'm gonna name him Pumbaa. Sylvian City, here we are. Woo! It'll only take us, like, an hour to do this. Woo! Let's go over here. Oh, wow, this is a definitely a big city. Okay, so we're gonna... First thing we wanna do is find the little training area. Here we go. Here he is. We're going to rest our Lumians. Yes, we're gonna re rest them and hopefully they should be okay. Here. Okay, here's our group. We have all this stuff right now. What we're gonna do is that we're gonna take out, um, what is this guy? Um, let's see. Summary. Cathorn is okay. I'm not sure how great Cathorn is. Um, Grubby is not great either. So we're going to take out Grubby. We're going to put him in here. We're going to put uh, our Gecklo in here. And then, uh, what is this? Cathorn? I don't know how good Cathorn is. At also, Chronocopia. Oh, not Cocoonocopia. Sorry, Cocoonocopia. And what is this? You are a Cathorn. Cathorn we're also going to take out. Uh, he hasn't been the best. And we're going to put him here. And we're going to put this guy up here. I don't know how great he is, but we're going to... How do we expand storage? We can't. Okay. Uh, okay. So, those people over here... Oh, here we go. Let us see. Oh, hello. Uh, hey, is this your first time in town? Uh, welcome to Sylvian City. I was just admiring the view of the battle theater from here. Oh, you're Lumion Trainer? Well, then you must stop by at the battle theater while you, uh, you're in town. And every trainer's goal to challenge Royal Battle Theaters, right? Well, good luck to you, pal. You're gonna need it. Uh, uh, thanks. Okay. So, we're gonna go in here. Hopefully, we can actually beat this guy. Her girl, let's see what's going on. Oh, cool, we're going in now. Woo! Hi there, you're just in time. We're looking for trainers to enter the Sylvian Battle Challenge. The adept that play through several rounds and then defeat the theater's battle star in the Lumion Battle. The battle is the, <laughs> is the strongest uh, trader in town, has earned their fame through the countless battles. If you complete these challenges, uh, Battle Star, you will receive Sylvia's Battle Theater Medal. Uh, if you're interested in participating, please talk to me. And hey there, trainer. Have you ever compared to the Battle Theater Challenge? We'll try, guys. We'll try. Great. Follow me. I don't think we're ready yet, but we shall try. Definitely. Let's see this. If your first round is about to begin, you will be asked to solve a puzzle and then battle a trainer. After that, you'll be able to come back and prepare for your next round. Are you ready to go on the stage? Let's go. Right this way, please. Well, we'll see how this goes. Obviously, I don't think I'm going to be able to do this in this maybe in this episode. We might have to try it again. Well, welcome to our next round to the stage. Uh-oh. Everyone give it up for Rizzy. Wow, there's like nobody here. <laughs> wow. I feel so loved. Please take your spot on stage. Oh, God. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, all right, crowd, you know the rules? Uh, I don't know the rules. Before we get to your challenge, you must solve this puzzle. Let's see what our first puzzle is. Uh-oh. I suck at puzzles. This isn't good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> uh-oh. The puzzle is simple. Uh, you must step on the green tiles to switch them on and off. Be careful, though, because many adjacent green tiles will also... Adjacent green tiles will also change when you do so. Turn turn on all turn on all of the green tiles to win. Okay, now let's find out for Zia what it takes. Okay. Oh, good, we did it. Uh, good job. First puzzle, ready to take on our challenger. Uh, what? Why? Who's ready for a battle? I'm not ready for a battle. Oh no. 
Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Wait, it's a bacon head thing. Uh, hey, if you want Bowser, you're gonna have to go through me. Oh no, oh god. Pasta, that's flat. What level are you? Uh, go, to, go, go, go. Uh, book pieces shine. Awesome. Uh oh. Yeah, it's not very effective, but it does kill him, which is good. Uh oh, oof, oof, that's all we gotta say. Okay, Rizzy 200 for winning. Awesome. Wow, what an amazing battle. Uh, congrats on your first battle, Rizzy. We'll be back for another round after a short break. Um, uh, yeah. With the start of round two, it's time for a puzzle. Oh, no, 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 no. So we probably won't be able to do this. What is this? Now we have black tiles. Oh, God. You're still for the move around with white tiles, but these black new ones may not be stopped on. Good luck. Okay, so I kind of said the first one with, like, uh, kind of, like, you know, down here. Cool, we did that. Awesome. You've come pretty far, but this is the end for you. I've not come pretty far. This is my second battle. Roger's a twat. Twat. Oh, twat. Okay. I'll pen use this tease. Tease, uh, feel self conscious. <laughs> oh, Pokey uses feel self conscious about the moves it uses. Oh, you. What? This move cannot be used. Excuse me, you made my Buckby feel self conscious about itself? Shame on you. My god. Okay, uh, we're gonna go to here. We're going to pounce. No one makes my eaglet feel um uh, uh, self conscious. My God, uh, you're almost ready to face Naya. Watch out! Uh oh, wow, that was quick. This is truly incredible. Another excellent performance by Rizzy. We'll be back sure after this break. Probably for some Rizzy final challenge. Oh no, I don't want to face this puzzle. These puzzle things are so strange. I don't understand them. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, I was kind of. Uh oh. Okay, we got this. Oh, we did it! Awesome, cool. Amazing work. Oh no, you've done a great job making this far. What the hell is this girl? What the heck? This is your first time challenge match leader, isn't it? Most trainers have at least a few medals in their belt before they challenge me. Just so you're new to this, this is me, you go down easily. If you want to see I want my medal, you have to beat me in a fair fight. Now let's teach a thing to about balance. Oh god, Naya. Oh, this is not this I'm gonna get pummeled. Oh no. I'm just gonna spare you it. Basically, I was very unprepared and got my butt kicked. So, uh yeah. <laughs> That was unfortunate. Rizzy no longer can fight. Rizzy has lost the battle. Rizzy paid entry to the winning. Rizzy turned to nearest house camps because the rest are Lumians. Oh well, guys. That was unfortunate. <laughs> I have to get some more stuff. We have to go train our Pokemon some more. Our Lumians some more. So, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please leave a like and a comment. Subscribe if you're new. If you have any tips with me on how to do this, um, please let me know. And I will see you guys in another video. Bye. Bye.